Question, what is the most important thing to look for in a hydrogen product? What up all my instrumented peeps? Thank you for voting on this Q&A poll. We really appreciate that you guys go out and do that uh, so I can come here and answer your questions in this type of way. Uh, and so this question this week uh, is kind of a loaded question. Um, you know, what is the most important thing uh, when looking for our hydrogen product? And so uh, there's actually a lot of different things we can talk about, um, but for the sake of the video, uh, we'll reduce it to really just two things for this answer. Um, and it's really not that hard of an answer. Um, but number one would be uh, you need to verify that the system actually produces hydrogen gas or dissolves it into water or whatever the product you're looking for. Um, and then number two, you need to do your best to verify um, how much is being produced. So let's go ahead and discuss the implications of those two things. Okay, so number one is the company or the product that you're investigating, the distributing company of that product. Uh, they should be, number one, uh, talking about hydrogen gas, uh, highlighting the fact that their product actually produces it. Number two, they should be talking or highlighting the fact that how much they're actually producing with this product, whether it's a hydrogen water product, the dissolved hydrogen concentration of that product. Uh, and then number three, um, you need to do all within your power uh, to verify yourself. So one simple and easy way to do that is with a reagent called H2Blue if you're looking at a hydrogen water product. You can actually test the dissolved hydrogen concentration for that particular product you're looking at whenever you purchase it uh, yourself at home. You should be verifying these things. And I actually produce a, a video uh, teaching you how to use H2Blue uh, and do it effectively at home. Uh, and so those are the three things that you need to be doing. Uh, well, the, the one thing you should be doing and the two things that they should be doing, those are uh, key features that you should, should be looking for uh, when it comes to uh, purchasing or investigating a hydrogen product. Okay, so another way that you can verify is actually through our sister company, H2Hub. Um, we actually test hydrogen products and actually produce test reports on them independent of the company's readings. And so, uh, rather extensive test reports, some might add. But, uh, but yeah, but you can actually go to our website and you can actually see the products that I've tested personally. Um, and you can actually verify um, what products that you might be interested in. And so, over the last... Uh, probably six years we've tested 50 to 60 plus um, hydrogen products and so if it's not on our site uh, the likelihood is we might have tested it or we might not but you can always email us or contact me um, and this is another way that you can actually verify um, which products on the market might provide therapeutic concentrations of hydrogen and which one don't uh, we actually have performance standards that we that we actually test these products against uh, to to do our part in verifying uh, if these products are actually providing therapeutic levels based on what is seen within the literature. And so this is another unique way that you can verify uh, these two important aspects when it comes to investigating hydrogen products. One more thing I might add about Issue Hub is that we actually test a wide array of hydrogen products. So hydrogen water, hydrogen inhalation, hydrogen bath. I mean, we cross the spectrum. Um, and so some products are easier to verify um, these things like hydrogen water. Um, than it would be for hydrogen inhalation or even hydrogen baths. Um, just other products are going to have more unique uh, or more challenges uh, to verifying them. And so we do the hard work so you guys don't have to. Okay, so you can use this as a resource when going through this process. Um, and we're here to help you navigate the therapeutic hydrogen industry or market. So we're going to be doing more videos about this uh, particular topic and basically uh, teaching uh, more ins and outs on hydrogen products. Um, and how they work, uh, and also uh, basically red flags or um, key things to look for uh, when it comes to uh, investigating or purchasing um, hydrogen products. And so we're going to do that more uh, this year and moving forward with H2 Minutes, and so I figured I would let you guys know that. So thank you to our patrons. We couldn't do these type of videos without them. And also thank you guys for voting. Uh, please vote on next month's Q&A. Um, so we can go ahead and answer your next question. Uh, and please be sure to follow us on all of our social media platforms, um, you know, YouTube, Twitter, uh, you know, Instagram, all of them. Uh, please make sure that you will follow us on those. And uh, we'll catch you next time. Deuces.